On Wednesday's episode of the Strictly spin-off show It Takes Two, host Jeanette Manrara spoke to actor Will Miller after his dancing debut last week. Talking about how he's finding the experience so far, he confessed his family have been overcome with emotion. Strictly's 20th series is officially underway as 15 stars took to the dance floor for the first time last Saturday after being put into their matches the night before. Actor Will was matched with Nancy as the pair performed the jive to live in La Vida Loca to judges Craig Revel Horwood, Moxie Mobuse, Shirley Ballas, and Anton Dubeka. Impressing them with their routine, the dancing duo managed to secure a score of 34 making them the highest in the competition alongside Hamza Yassin. Appearing on Strictly It Takes Two, the contestant spoke to Jeanette Manrara about how he's found competing in the show so far. Strictly Come Dancing Couples, full list of 2022 pairings and which pro didn't get partner Strictly Come Dancing fans finally found out who would be dancing with whom in the new series with the launch show airing. The launch was initially postponed following the death of Queen Elizabeth II but the show aired on September 23. A total of 15 famous faces took to the dance floor for the first time as they met their dance partners. See the full list of pairings here. Admitting that once he'd done his routine he was left tingling until the next morning, Will told the former Strictly professional that being part of the show is a big deal for him and his family. He said, I was tingling until the next morning, my body was on fire, I was tingling, it was exhilarating, it was emotional, it was everything. I don't think there's any other show that will give you that type of feeling, especially doing something that's completely out of your comfort zone. If you feel like you've done it, the achievement and the sense of achievement was unbelievable. My daughter was crying, I looked down, my daughter was crying. My mom's on the phone crying, it was massive for me and my family. Elsewhere in the interview, they touched on the judge's feedback that Will received after Motsi gave him a standing ovation. However, they also commented on Craig's critique of him lacking retraction as Jeanette asked if he'd struggled with that during rehearsals that week. The actor confessed that because he didn't know what the judge meant by retraction, he wasn't bothered by it. He added, I was that buzzing that they could have said anything and I wouldn't have cared. I was just like, I've made my kids happy and I was happy with that. I was buzzing. My fingers, my toes I was tingling I was just like, what a moment, what happened? Jeanette jokingly commented that she feels as though he's still on a buzz from his first routine after he managed to pull off an impressive routine. Next week, it's been revealed that Will and Nancy will be dancing to Luther Vandross' song Never Too Much as they tackle the tango. Although Will and Hamza are currently at the top, that could all change next week as their total scores at the moment will be added to what they next get. At the bottom of the leaderboard is football star Tony Adams and his partner Katya Jones who received a total score of 15. Other dances viewers can expect to see this Saturday include country file star Helen Skelton doing the cha-cha, comedian Jade Adams doing the tango and loose women's Kay Adams doing the Charleston. Strictly Come Dancing continues Saturday on BBC One from 6.30pm.